What's going on boys and girls? My name is DJ Ketchup and I'm here today to read to you guys Donovan's Word Jar by Mona Lisa DeGrasse. This is one of my books that I have actually read back in my times when I was a little kid just like you guys. Donovan Allen enjoyed being like all the other kids in Mrs. In Mrs. Panky's third grade class. He liked wearing a yellow shirt with brown pants and a button-down sweater just like the other boys. When the bell rang at the end of the day he grabbed his book bag and ran for the door, just like the other kids. And just like the other kids on the days when his mom packed raw broccoli and cauliflower in his lunch, Donovan forgot to eat them. Like most of the kids in his class, Donovan liked to collect things. A few kids in his class collected rocks, insects, or stamps. Some of the other kids collected coins, comics, or baseball cards. Donovan's best friend Eric collected marbles. Eric was always playing with marbles, trading marbles, reading about marbles, and searching for the perfect marble. He kept his marble collection in a leather pouch with his name stamped on it. Donovan's buddy Pooh collected buttons of all shapes and sizes. Pooh kept his button collection pinned to a cork board sorry, in his bedroom. He collected buttons from almost every event he went to. He had buttons from movies, baseball games, and amusement parks. Pooh's favorite button was one of his, the one his father had made for him for his birthday. Of it was a picture of Winnie the Pooh, and written about it were the words, Pooh for President. Pooh kept that button pinned to his book bag. But when it came to collecting things, Donovan Allen was different. He had a collection like no one else. He knew Donovan collected words. Yes, words. The end.